115 years, the graves of a husband and wife have been unmarked at a cemetery in Cuyahoga Falls. But all that's about to change. John and Emily Hansparker were former slaves in the South before moving to Cuyahoga Falls. As Bob Jones shows us, local organizers choosing a special day right now to give them the respect they deserve. In Oakwood Cemetery, you'll find headstones for people who served in the Marine Corps in Vietnam, in the Navy during Korea, in the Army during World War II, and even a memorial to soldiers who served in the Civil War. But in Section B, Lot 621, there are unmarked graves. No way to honor the people buried here. I think it's time to do that reckoning and to take the time to acknowledge that their life mattered, that they are important. After digging through old photos and records, the Cuyahoga Falls Historical Society determined John Hans Parker, who was a slave in Virginia before he was freed and came to Cuyahoga Falls, is buried at one of the unmarked graves. So is his wife Emily and either their child or a stepchild. So to be able to say, you know, John Hans Parker was here. Sean Andrews did some of the detective work and found it extremely meaningful. There's even more of an importance there that these were folks who a lot of times were not able to trace their history. And now plans are in the works to finally mark the Hansparker's final resting place. Fundraising is underway to buy a gravestone that will look like this. Sonny Matthews is helping to organize. I don't know if I'll be able to get through it without crying because this is my chance to stand at an ancestor's grave. The ceremony will take place on June 19th, known as Juneteenth, a day that observes the end of slavery in the U.S. So for me, Juneteenth is a time to honor, it's a time to commemorate, it's a time to celebrate. At this cemetery, there's a lot of history you can see and plenty you cannot. In 12 days, people will gather here to make sure a man who escaped slavery and is seen smiling in an old photo is not forgotten. I hope John smiles again. There are many more unmarked graves in Oakwood Cemetery. Some in this area are believed to be the final resting places of other black people. The hope is one day they too will receive proper gravestones. In Cuyahoga Falls, Bob Jones, News